Hey guys, got a quick video in which I'm going to show you how to install the MySQL world database on your MySQL server. So we start by downloading the zip file which contains all the world database SQL statements that are going to create the data, the tables, and the database itself. So I'm going to link in the description below each of these commands, but I'll go ahead and tell you what each of them does. The wget command uses a the wget command downloads a file from the web onto your server and you just type in wget space and the URL of the file you'd like to download. In this case it's wget uh, and a URL to world.sql.gz which is a zip file. So we run that command and a moment later it's completed and what we need to do now is we need to unzip the file. So I'm going to come back over here and type in g unzip world.sql.zip.gz, which is the file that we just downloaded. And it says, if we've already done it, it says, do you wish to overwrite? We say yes. Uh, you probably won't get that prompt because you haven't downloaded it previously like I have. Now, once we've downloaded and unzipped the file, we need to log in to MySQL. So we're going to use that uh, command from our previous videos, sudo mysql-u root, which will log us into MySQL as root. Now you'll notice the command prompt changes to a MariaDB, which is just a variation of MySQL, and it shows that we are logged in. Now that we have downloaded the file, unzipped the file and then logged in to MySQL, we are going to run the source command followed by the name of the file, which is going to read that file and execute all the SQL statements that you see in it. So I hit enter and you'll see that all these queries run. And now we are actually in the world database as evidenced by the command prompt saying MariaDB world. And if I type show tables, you can see it has created a city, country, and country language table. So that is the quick start on how to download and create the world database in MySQL on a Google Cloud virtual machine.